Hi everyone. So I thought I'd do a quick video just explaining why I like using the Happy Planner. First of all, they're very cute and pretty. They come in lots of different styles, sizes, themes. Um, I like the setup of them. Gives you full view of this year, last year. Gives you separate months. So you can see that. It goes, uh, tells you like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then the, the number and the meat. I like the monthly overview page which you can use for practically anything. I use it as a currently page. I've used it as a memory page. I've also done, filled out this page and done it at the beginning of the month. And I've also finished this page at the end of the month. So I'll do like what I'm looking forward to, or I'll do a summary. So you can do anything you want with that page. I love, love the dividers the monthly dividers they all match and they're always colorful and I find them so cute and this book specifically actually had a sticker book that came out that had all the matching colors and figure or er, figures cats um, unfortunately I couldn't find one so I didn't get it still hoping I can find one um, so then you get a monthly overview so you, I use this as um, reminder of e dates or events like birthdays and holidays vacation I don't do like daily writing in them it's just kind of a overview of the month and then I love this layout so this is a classic vertical classic planner vertical layout and it's got the three boxes going down and Monday to Sunday across with the notes um, I find this one to be the easiest to decorate with and it also gives me an option of going like morning afternoon night or i could do um, meal planning exercise appointments gives you a lot of different options so those are the reason the reasons i like using this specific planner now for decorating all the pages come out you can just pull them out set your plant oh the sun's coming out set your planner aside and just decorate the pages move them around spin them you don't have to worry about um, anything in the middle from blocking your hand movements so I love that and then they are so easy to put in take out put in just pop them back in and you're back to flipping pages now the cool thing about this is that the covers come off also so I could if I didn't want the cats I could take the front cover off this is the back cover of the cats Take the back cover off and flip them around. So now it says plan a happy life and just stick this back on here, back on the rings. And there you go. I have a different looking planner. And of course, then you could put the front cover it over and and there you have it so now this is what my planner looks like 
I, of course, want the cats on it. Simple. You can see just how quick this is to flip around. Okay. So the other thing is you can change out the plastic discs. So I've got purple discs on this one. I can't, I don't know if you can tell. These are like a black see-through speckled type disc. I've got rainbow discs. These ones are rose gold. Sorry about the lighting. The It's cloudy, partly cloudy. So I'm getting sun and getting clouds at the same time. So you could take take these rings off. I'm not going to show you how to do it because it, it, it's going to take takes a little while. So, but you could I would take like maybe one month at a time. You can take it off carefully, and then if you had your discs set up, you could add discs on different colored discs on so you get the idea see so now this page this has purple discs but i'm not gonna go through that whole whole thing with you just now i'm just gonna put it back in so you can see just how easy it is to move everything around okay so you can change your covers you can change your discs you can also buy, um, I just got this in the States. It's called, it's a custom cover. So what it is, is it has a slot at the top. So you can put anything in there. You can print off a big photo of your family. You can get scrapbook paper, cut it out. And you'll have a customized cover. And again, you just clip it onto the rings and you have a customized cover. And it comes with a the back cover too. So you get the two pieces. So you can customize that. Um, let's see, what other goodies does can you get? Well, you can get a, um, individual sheets. So this is a day, this is daily sheets. Uh, you can also get notebook sheets and they come in different styles. So you can get those and you can also get um, what they call page protectors. So that's 12 sheets. I don't know how well you can see that, but I've got a couple pulled here. Um, let's pull the, move it out of the way. So they're split with pockets so you can put pictures in, or if you need more space one week, you can, um, here's another one, you can put littler pictures in. You can put in cards in here to for planning. Like let's say you have a big birthday that week. You can put a card in here for, for um, what you need to buy, a card for what you need to do, food you need to buy, recipes. So you can do like all kinds of stuff with these sheets. And again, they just easily clip into the book. So simple. Okay, and then, so these are just a few of the goodies that I have. So you can also get, um, this one says line it up. This one says check it off. So the, it's checklists. So this one has circles. This one has squares. And what you can do with those, you can use them for two different things. One, you clip them into your book. And you can use it as a cat hair. Too much cat hair in this house. You can clip it into your book. And you can use it as a page marker 
or its true intention is to, you just light, it fits perfectly inside the classic squares. More cat hair. And you just take a pen and do a circle, circle, line, 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 line. And you can make your own checklists. Circles or squares. See, so if you, I don't, if you can tell, so the first box, the second box, and the third box lines up perfectly. So love those. Uh, you can make sheets to put inside of it. Just, you, this one I bought, it's, I can't even remember where I bought it from, but it, it's like a pad and you just rip off a sheet as you need it. Uh, this one here I made out of an a, uh, old recollections planner, little planner. I ripped all the pages out and then I, you can get um, a hole punch. You can get hole punches from the Happy Planner that will allow you to punch these holes into the paper. They have a couple different ones. I actually have one that I got at Staples. Um, it's heavy duty. <laughs> Let me see. To zoom out a little here. Oh, not in, out. Oh, I can't zoom out any farther. So, but yeah, this is the one from Staples. It's heavy duty. So you can uh, add in grocery lists. This is what, this is the one I use probably the most right here. I'll do uh, grocery list, oops, sorry, grocery list, to-do list, and I just add it into the week that I'm, I need it. Um, ugh, there's so many other things that I don't have that you can get. You can get all kinds of page markers. I have my page marker in the book that I'm using right now. So this is one of the page markers that I have right now. So you can see the tab goes over the top and it's so easy to find the week that you're on. So that's some of the things that I like about the Happy Planner, but probably my favorite is the sticker books. So you can get hundreds of different sticker books. Um, the thing about the Happy Planner sticker books, I will use the, let's use colorful boxes. Um, the stickers are made to fit in the planner. Ugh, I can't get the, my fingers to work here. Oh, what's going on here? I'm ripping my sticker. Ah. Okay. So as you can see, the sticker fits right perfectly inside the little box. And then you get like half boxes. So what else do we have in here? There's, that's half boxes. That other one's a quarter box. And this is just the one book. Here's headers. So let me just flip through this book. If I can get my fingers to work. Okay, so some, some longer headers. A couple different colors. Clear arrows. Word bubbles some sayings, lots of sayings, different colored uh, boxes from the front. Those are, these ones here look like they're probably brighter. Here's some uh, clear flowers. And then these are like pastels again. So lots of different 
that's just one book. Like, I mean, I can quickly flip through watercolor. What is this one? Watercolor goals. So you can see this, like, this book is quite a bit different. But so many choices in sticker books. Probably my most favorite thing about using the Happy Planner. And there are a lot of other people that um, make sticker books. This one here is Live Love Posh. And this one is Amber Plans Her Day, for example. And they make stickers, which you can use in your Happy Planner. Oh, the sun's coming back out again, so we're getting some shading. So, I love I love their sticker books and the colors, different things that they've got. So that's fantastic. So I think what I'll do is a video showing some of my favorite sticker books, and I'll do a video with tips and tricks. I'm starting to make a list and probably do tools like what I use when I'm planning and decorating. So please follow me. It's Lisa P. Crafts. I'm on YouTube and Instagram and I just started uh, putting my stuff on Pinterest today and looking at doing a Facebook, Facebook page this weekend. So please follow me and uh, please give me some thumbs up and some likes and we'll see you soon thanks everyone